So what you're looking at here is the Twyford motor car. It was started here in Brookville in about 1905. Um, the vehicle is known as the first four-wheel drive in the country. Um, however, it didn't take off due to lack of capital, and uh, Twyford actually ended up moving to Texas um, shortly after the company uh, went under. The first four-wheel drive built in the same town where a man whose family owned a service station took the first ever international flight. Uh, Louis Earl Sant was uh, born and raised in Brookville here in the early 1900s. He um, is internationally known for the first flight uh, from Erie, Pennsylvania to Canada. Um, he actually did crash when he made it to Canada, but he walked to shore. Uh, so he's, um, he's well known in Brookville, well known across the world uh, for aviation. Brookville and Jefferson County also played a big role in the Civil War. The 105th was instrumental at Gettysburg. They were on the peach orchard, the wheat field, um, and uh, they lost, you know, they lost men just like every other regiment. However, um, many of these men are well known in town. About 1,500 men fought for the North from 1861 to 1865 when the regiment mustered out. During the same time, a local historian, Kate Scott, who was actually born in Cambria County, is rumored to have had an affair with one of the most notorious killers in American history. Kate is uh, rumored to have had a daughter to John Wilkes Booth. However, the History Center, um, our curator here, Carol Briggs, has done significant research to disprove that fact or rumor. 